stay on the left platform here. Just so you won't go in. Have a toasty Mario. Yeah, so it's pretty much just uh, dodging everything and making sure you don't get smashed or burnt. That'd be very bad. And if you unlock the green switch, then uh, appear there and you get your power up. So now on to the boss fight. Now this one, there are three things that will come up, and only one of them will have the correct boss. So you have to jump on him while also dodging. The fireball. Uh, Okay, so, uh, Lemmy's Castle is now completed. And I just realized that yet again, sorry, I'm still trying to get used to this, but yet again, I forgot to, uh, time it at the 10 minute mark. Which sucks. But, meh. So I guess I'll just go ahead and keep on going until it gets to about the 20 minute mark. Anyway, so uh, y'all yeah, going to um, continue and save. Um, let's see. I'm going to go ahead and go back real quick to get some power-ups from the top secret area. The other one just has another mushroom, so didn't really need that one. But of course you have to be big first, I believe, in order to get the feathers. I think it's the left ones that give out the mushrooms, the right one that gives out the feathers. So now that we are here, go up to the cheese bridge area. Okay. Make sure you have Yoshi on this one as well. Go ahead and activate all three here, and get on the lower one. Get your first Yoshi coin. Okay, come on, pass, 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 thank you. And yes, Yoshi can jump on the saws, so you don't have to worry about getting hit there. And then get on the lower one again for the third Yoshi coin. And get on the upper one to go through there. Now, like I said, you need Yoshi for this level. Um, and you can spend the rest of your time just going really, or going through this level, you know, going through all the difficulties. Or, uh, you can use a little, uh, I wouldn't really call it a cheat because it provides you with it. Uh, they're actually called Yoshi Wings. Have Yoshi, hit the wings, and you go up here into the level. And you will fly through the sky here, and just get the rest of the, uh, dinosaur balls. Yoshi balls. Dinosaur balls. And now you have all five. And the level may possibly provide you with more. I don't know if it will or not. Yes, it will. 
So, anytime that there is more than five Yoshi coins, then the rest of them will, uh, give you one up. So that's why it's best to go through this area. And also, whenever you actually exit this area, um, yeah, right here, whenever you actually exit this area, you'll complete the level. It's really simple. Just drop down, and that is actually counted as a normal exit. Very simple. Okay, so, and oh yeah, also as you can see, Yoshi turns blue, I guess, oh, maybe lack of oxygen from flying up in space, anyway, so, now, as you can see, there's a red dot, so there's a secret air, uh, exit here, so, let's see. go ahead and go in here, and for the secret exit, you must have Yoshi and, uh, Caped Mario. So, first things first, instead of stepping on all three of those platforms, start here at the left, run, at the very end, jump, and keep, um, uh, keep B held down, and Yoshi will actually jump to the very end here. And yeah, you could have done that at first, but if you wanted all the Yoshi coins, just to go into those, because I don't... Oh yeah, I guess you could have done that as well, with the Yoshi wings, but... For some reason, whenever I try doing that, to get all the Yoshi coins, or dinosaur coins, uh, from the Yoshi wings, it only provided me with four up there. I have no idea why, but it happens. Anyway, so, here, start left again. Jump. Skip all this. Oh, okay, and whenever you get to the yellow pipe, go to the end here, jump, and you'll be here at the exit. So see, without the Yoshi wings, you would have gone through all that. Hmm. So, I really hope I get it on this one. So, you'll see the normal exit here, but the secret exit is actually behind that one. So the way to get there is you'll have to get Yoshi, fly down below the exit, and do the Yoshi jump to go behind it. Sacrificing Yoshi. Poor Yoshi. Oh well. And just run, jump, and this moon gives you three lives. And do the secret exit. Okay. So, now we are at Soda Lake, which, as you can see, is in water. So, joy, another underwater level. Luckily, though, this one only has a normal exit. But, unfortunately, though, they'll have these uh, bullet dudes here. I forget what their official name's called. But... You can if you want get that, but like I said, you can also kill the fishies with the cape. <laughs> this one you have to actually time pretty well. Yeah, no, I'm gonna get that. Yeah, that Yoshi coin is actually kind of difficult to get. There's only been like once or twice whenever I was actually able to get it uh, without getting hit. Anyway, get the second Yoshi coin. Small Mario. Fourth Yoshi coin. And the last one. Over the fishies. Or swim over the fishies, I should say. Can't really jump. Walk on the bottom if you're small. 
or you can always duck behind, or below those. And... Exit! Uh, and... 19, and as you can see I already have 97, so that'll go above 100, so now I'll have the little uh, special area, which I'll go ahead and do real quick. And I'll cut it off after this, if I have enough time. Ah, crap. One, two, three. Because of the diagonal. So I'll go ahead and cut it off here, and I will talk to you all on the next vid. So, yeah. Oh, and also, as you can see, it comes down to another Star World Warp Point, which I will not go to. So, yeah. Anyway, uh, adios.